Okay. Um. And then I had said, basically, I'm trying to order lenses. I'm having a lot of trouble. Usually what I do is get prescription clear, and I wear these over or under colors because I can't afford prescription colors. And um, recently I bought some really crappy colored lenses, and they stuck to the clears and tore them to bits. I wanted to know, and I said, or is it worth adding my prescription? And she had said... Um, she's familiar with what I'm looking to get. Sorry to learn I'm having trouble placing my order. There should be no problem with the artist's paint on those lenses. We They use a very high quality lens. Not sure about doing Plano and wearing them doubled up. Do the investment. It may be to my advantage to get them with the correction so there's no risk of damaging them. And so I thought that was a good idea. That's what I did. I said, um... I want to know if they're all right because the last pair of clear contacts I bought were so thick as soon as I took them off they split in half. I would not want to lose my heavens that way. And she said it's a complete prescription and it's adequate whatever you know still talking about ordering. Still checking if you got my payment because I hadn't heard anything. And I had asked for a list of contact solution and she hadn't given it to me. And then she said yes it was or it was approved and my orders in process didn't even talk about my next one I said here what was the lens solution had to ask her again this is where once the money goes through they kind of stop really answering you as much here's where she told me what solution was good I said I found them thanks um, I said I was wondering if they're if when they're painting my lenses you can make sure they do the rim a dark color, as I like the contrast, and the middle not uniform. I don't want it all blue or all green, but nice blend of the two. I don't want to send them back, so I want to be sure I get all the little details in before it's too late. I'm trying to work with them, trying to talk with them. And then, um, I will print and include this message for the artist. And there's my address being changed. Okay, we will make the change. And then I said, there's a problem here. Oh, I think what happened was you guys must have sent me someone else's lenses. Because this is obviously when I got the lenses. And they were completely screwed up. And I apologize. I'm unable to send you prepaid postage label because you're not a domestic customer. Unfortunately, you will have to pay to ship them back to us. Take and email me a photo or several in different lighting conditions so the artist can see what you received, how they look on you, what corrections may need to be made to them, and we will get... When we get them back here to the lab, the best I can offer you is free shipping. When we send your adjusted lenses back to you, as normally it is our policy to charge the customer for this again, which is bullshit because they fucked it up. And then I said, you know, I see this was what the heading of the other one was, the click and ship problem. And I copied this to show them again. That I was worried from the very start. What if my contacts were made wrong? And I said, and then it happened. That color looks nothing like heaven. They don't feel right. The color is off. I even went back and watched all the videos. Not to mention, again, there's no prescription, which is why I said, I think somehow mine must have gotten mixed up with someone else's because it isn't a simple wrong color. It's the entire lens. They didn't even match up on my eyes. One sagged down and one pointed straight. So I don't care who I have to talk to, but I just don't have the cash or the mindset to be made to pay for these when it was all your fault, not yours personally, but on your end. I had a photo shoot coming up that I needed these for, and I was bragging about these lenses, and now with this, I don't have time to make the CD cover before the release, and now I have to tell everyone why. Because I had a shoot schedule that I couldn't even do. Um, I had a lot of other models and fans who knew I was getting these and really wanted to know how they were, and it's like, what am I supposed to say? Well, not only did I lose the job because they didn't come in right, but the entire lens is wrong. Plus, they make you pay for it on top of the cost of the lenses. I really love the way the lenses look, assuming I ever get the right pair, because you can see the potential even with these, so I don't want to give bad reviews. Not that you guys probably care. So I said, I don't want to give bad reviews. So I said it right there. Not that you guys probably care because you have so many customers, but I do have well over 8,000 people who fan me and follow me, so at least my review will have some effect. Anyways, I'm just disappointed all around. I asked for them to look just like the video link. They don't. 
There's not even a hint of green or blue here. It's just gray. The brown starburst in the middle is too small and therefore doesn't blend into the eye enough as you can see in photo 428. I don't want it huge, just a tad more to help blend because as it stands now, these just come off as slightly better made cheap contacts. They don't look real. I also asked for the ring around the outside to be darker, a natural looking dark but still darker, and the line is uneven and virtually invisible in some spots. After those problems again, there's the fact that these are not the prescription. I paid, what, $150 extra when I was advised to do so and in the end didn't even get them. It would almost be easier to scrap these and make me a new pair because I have not one idea how you'll put prescription onto an already made lens because I was told they have to be cut a certain way. Think about it. I was really, really upset. And I don't know where the photos are. Um, the photos uh, are in one of my other videos about how crappy they actually looked. Um, I think my first video, at the end of the video, I have the three photos that I took. Um, it says, these are some photos that I took when I originally tried them on before I called you. If you need more, I'll take more. But as you can see, it is not heaven. I don't know how you can adjust them because they came to me Plano and as you know I paid for prescription. I'm beyond livid at this mistake because I was already worried about this happening and it did and now you're trying to tell me I have to pay for return shipping when start to finish it was your guys' mistake. I didn't think my order would ever have been messed up this bad especially not the prices you charge. So much care should be taken that the customer gets the actual right lens they paid for. I still 100% don't agree with having to dish out a single cent to fix these. I already paid $800, and I not only don't have any cash to spare, but again, this was in no way my fault. So I think you guys need to figure something out. Mail me something if possible. It's so incredibly unfair. And that's where I said, I even said, blah, 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 and that's where I copied it again. And she said, I have reviewed your photos with our supervising artist, and you do have heaven lenses. They actually look very good in the photos, so we are having trouble seeing any issue you're complaining about. We can read and inspect them for the proper prescription if you want to send them back, and even tone them down if you really want them darker, which is not what I had been telling her. So obviously, you see, she's not reading what I've said. And if we find that they are not the correction you ordered, we will have no problem replacing them for you. However, we did not make a mistake or send you someone else's lenses, so you will have to pay to return them. They did make a mistake because there was no prescription. I said, I've replied twice, no answer, you know, because this is going backwards, so it's, you know, kind of, uh, she said, we do not comp lenses, if you send them back and they need to replace, you will get the replacement only, and I was like, fine, fine, whatever, because I had said, um, Jesus, you guys really do like to put people out, don't you? You screw up, make the customer pay shipping on your mistake, won't cover that charge, and would rather throw away a pair of perfectly good, if wrong, lenses rather than send them back to at least give me something for having to pay return shipping on a mistake you made. I never thought from the feedback I've seen from your site that you guys are such utter assholes, but apparently not enough real and bad feedback has been put out there about you. I think people should know how you guys really are and what they risk by ordering from you. I know that if I knew that you guys can't get a simple order right, then I would have gotten, say, my car fixed instead of throw away $800 and be asked to shell out more, and had every offer rejected by you guys when you guys should be sorry for screwing up and wanting to keep me as a customer. Which I think are all good points. And then she said, Please be reassured that we will not have any problem reimbursing you for the amount you must pay to ship them back to us once we have inspected the lenses and verified if we did indeed make an error. However, we need to get the lenses back to the lab before we can do that, and we will need to see your receipt from the Postal Service you used to return them so that we can remit to you the proper amount. I also had to pay insurance on it, which I was not reimbursed for, and that was quite a bit. Once they've arrived here, should we find something that requires replacement of the lenses, we will be disposing of the lenses you have returned. We are one of the only FDA-approved and regulated labs, and it is against a lot of resell, or in your case, comp lenses that have been used. Which, I mean, that initially made sense to me, but then again, it's like, wait a minute, they were mine. I was the only one to wear them, so that kind of shouldn't really matter. They were just being stingy in my, in, from my point of view.